Welcome, folks, to yet another Let's Play. As you can see, this time it's not a strategy game, but it's something different. This is Silver. It's an action RPG. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to do a, a classic RPG yet, but this is a good start-off, I think. So, yeah, Silver was made in 1999 by Infogrames, and since then I think I've played it about through a, two or three times to the end. So, what can I say about the game? The game is really good, actually. I like it. I like the storyline, I like the characters, and especially I like the boss fights. And you will notice when I say there's a boss fight incoming, that I'm probably going to be a bit tense about them, because sometimes the bosses are really hard to beat. And I died a lot of times in my days back on certain bosses, and I don't want to um, let that happen again here. So, yeah, Silver has some quite old graphics, so nothing too fancy. But I think the game is quite good in gameplay mode. So, yeah. Let's look at the options and see what we can actually do here. Yeah, you see, not much. The game is old, so you can't expect that much. We leave the brightness as it is, maybe a little bit more. If we can do... yes. Uh, the menu auto close, yes, we want the energy bars always. You will see that later why that's so important. Uh yeah, auto change weapons, we want dialogue speech and we're not left handed. The sound I've turned the sound volume down a little bit. For some reason, by the way, the intro music is considered sound effect and not music for some reason. So I had it leave it up at this point but I'm probably going to reduce it just a little for the in-game volume later on. So yeah, folks, this is Silver. And I'm sorry about the uh, intro sequence that I can't show you, because for some reason it crashes the game. I have no idea why. Um, I tried it differently on uh, the last time I played this game, and s somehow it worked. But this time I start the game and tried it, it just crashes all the time. I've rolled back to uh, older graphics drivers, but it doesn't seem to fix the problem. And I didn't install anything different between my last playthrough and now. So yeah, I'm at a loss of what to do. So I'm sorry for not showing you the intro movie. You have to be without it for now. Maybe I'll find another way to record it later. So for now, I'm going to show you Silver. So, let's start right off, folks. Silver is coming for you. Be silent for Lord Fuse! It is decreed that all women of childbearing age will be taken before the Emperor's Silver, so that he may choose a new wife. Any man or woman found impeding this order will be charged with treason and sentenced to immediate execution. You abuse your power. This is a violation of our rights. What rights? You belong to the Emperor. He will do as he pleases. Guards, seize the women. William. Our time will come. I trust no one else has a problem, because I've indulged your whining long enough. Guards, you have your orders. Move the women to the galleon now! We'll search the outskirts of town and ensure that no one attempts to evade their duty. They're pretty mean, aren't they? They're taking all the women away. However, there's our main character coming on, the blonde dude to the left. That's us. You're late. And you're you looking the wrong practice. way, Grandfather. You need to practice. Are you in such a hurry to be beaten, Grandfather? Yes. Unfortunately, I'm constantly disappointed. But at least my student has confidence. Now, go into the house and get your blade. Amaze me with your swordsmanship. 
I'm pretty sure you will be amazed about me. Just let me get my sword and my shield, and you'll see how much I can do with that. So, yeah, with this blonde dude here, his name... Can we see that somehow? Um, yeah, we can. His name is David, he is level 1, his hit points are 96, his magic are 37, he has got 46 strength, 34 dexterity, a range skill of 31, constitution of 38, wisdom of 25, and an armor class of 11. And we have 6 gold, so we're quite rich. No, we're not. 6 gold is nothing for later usage. So yeah, David is actually a close combat fighter, which you can see by, well, the increased strength in comparison to dexterity, and he has a better bunk of hit points than any other character at this point. Or rather, the only character at this point. So yeah, let's go into the house and see what we can do here. Oh, I didn't hear you get up. Hello. I wanted to practice with Grandfather, but you look so peaceful, I didn't want to wake you. Have you eaten? You'll need to keep healthy to have any chance of beating him. I will. Yeah, eat healthy and you will beat him. For that matter, let's get this apple. Yum. Yeah, so food is our hit point regeneration system here. If you pick up food, invest it wisely at the beginning, because you won't get that much. A shield and a sword. And to show you some things about this game, this is the radial menu. Top is food. To the right is magic that we don't have yet. Then we have ranged stuff, which we don't have yet. Magical items, which we don't have yet. The backpack, which shows us the character screen, as I clicked before. Potions and keys. This, very important. Keys you will find a lot in this game. Then we've got defense values, and this time the shield. And attack stuff, like the sword. And this one is reserved for special powers that we don't have yet. But that's no problem. Okay, let's go out then and battle our grandfather. Now we can begin. Yes. Hold your sword ready and never take your eyes off your opponent. I won't. We'll start with some basic moves that will ease you into combat. Fine. Now you try. Yeah, the main controls in this game is Press your control key and then use the mouse to do something, like attack or something else. So let's click left here. Good. I see I'll have to provide you with more of a challenge. Yes. More. Next, we should try the lunge. When performed well, this move is deadly. Oh yes, it is. The lunge, one of my favorite moves in this game. So let's get the mouse up. Good. A powerful movement. You learn quickly. Yeah, and now, a swipe requires a little more skill than a lunge, but less accuracy. Stand fast, and in one swift move, swipe hard to your right. Like this. Yeah, thank you. Um, the lunge is the damage, uh, it's the attack that does the most damage at the beginning, so you might want to use that a lot in the beginning. Uh, you want to move right, okay. Very elegant. I hope your opponents appreciate such artistry. They'll I have don't no choice. Think It'll so. be the last thing they ever see. Yeah, right. Always consider your assailant's position. This will help determine whether you perform the right swipe or readjust your stance and swipe left. The right side. Ah, he's rolling the R so beautifully. Ah, uh, left side. Good. Now we'll try a different approach. Yeah. One-on-one -on -one combat is rare. It's more likely that you'll face several assailants at any one time. We do? So you have to be prepared for anything. Sure. And this move is vital. Okay, show me. Very few of your opponents will have any pride, and would rather leap at you from behind than face you directly. Learn this move well. 
I will, but however, we have to reserve that for next video, folks. So when we come back, more silver and more training.